Hello everyone, welcome to the stream. Welcome to Girl Stream. <clears throat> team. To, welcome to Girl Stream in a team. It's time to in. team and stream and girl. Ah. And keep our coral. Yeah. Ah, oh, I'm <laughs> I'm sad I didn't realize that you'd sent me um <laughs> track to play. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, <Sorry>. next <laughs> Maybe next time. Maybe next time. We need to get hype. Oh, I mean, I feel hype. <clears throat> I feel hype. No, oh. because I'm sleepy. Understandable. Finger guns. Yeah. I didn't think that I'd started the game, but apparently I had, and I guess it's just been kind of sitting there, started oh. for a bit. Sweet. Neat. Oh, thank you, Lily. That's all sleep's doing. Oh, yeah. I did some floors. Yeah, I don't know what happened here, but some <clears> of the <throat> tiles got ripped up for some reason. Oh. It's probably this jerk. <laughs> Just running around, ripping up the tiles. Like a joik. Like a joke. Like a, like a joke. What? A joke that he is. A new running talent just for me. Oh. I'm gonna go and collect the scarlet from our funny drill that we set up. When was Warrior Cats? That's a good question. When was Warrior Cats? Hmm. This worm is a joy going to block him away to work. No, no, no. Wor Wormy nice. Wormy is protesting and blocking everyone's <laughs> way to work. Exactly. It's on strike for better worming conditions. <laughs> Yummy or dirt. <laughs> Yummy or dirt. dirt. Yeah, admittedly, I thought that Warrior Cats was a... a... I swear I keep thinking you're going to say Wario Cats. <laughs> Wah! <laughs> Meow! <laughs> oh, boof! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, was Wario in that one uh, Mario game where they got cats? I don't think so. Hmm. Oh yeah, unnatural twenty. I wicked thought it was just a bit. I I thought, okay, warrior cats. He he, who who. <laughs> wouldn't it be silly if there was a a book about that? And it's not, no, it's it's a real genuine book that book series that is apparently kind of good. So once again, showing. Um, Showing what I know. <laughs> Snuffy, the inflation VTuber. Hmm. God. I was neither an Animorphs kid nor a Warrior Cats kid. I I think the Animorphs books were probably distributed in the UK. Yeah, I missed I missed the Animorphs boat somehow. I'm not mm -hmm. terribly certain how. Well, I mean, it wasn't really a boat. It was a boy that had turned himself into a boat. Ah. Oh. From the sister series, Boatomorphs. Boatomorphs, of course. Every time you eat seafood, you turn into a boat. Yeah. <laughs> oh, is it, is it time for our annual turbo teen reference? <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> I was my my selection of kid books? Question mark. Um, 
I was big into the Goosebumps series. That was my shit. And oh then, yeah, I love me and some Goosebumps. Redwall after that. Mm -hmm. Hey, oh geez, regrettably, uh, Harry Potter. Admittedly, like you know, <laughs> I was a child. This is before Rowling turned out to be just the worst person. <laughs> <laughs> Arl Stein also wrote Eureka's Castle. Excuse me? I I feel like it's been so long since I've thought of Eureka's Castle that I can't quite remember what it is, but I know it was a childhood obsession because <laughs> I, I feel it in my blood. Oh, would you like to let me in on what the fuck Eureka's Castle is? Uh, it was like a, you know... And stuff. Oh, in enlightening. <laughs> it was like a, it was like a, a Muppets. It wasn't Muppets, but it was like a Muppets. Okay, it was legally distinct Muppets. Oh, exactly. that sounds that sounds kind of rad, actually. Yeah, the female gnome wizard, Coddle Wag, the big dragon. Wait, Coddle Wag from Twitter? <laughs> I'm, I, well, I'm looking it up, but I'm looking at this bespectacled oh. bat, and I can't <laughs> help but think about it. I remember this giant fella, and I remember the, the wizard girl, and I kind of remember the, the dragon who looks a lot like Plessy from fucking Mario Odyssey. <laughs> Dang. Oh, oh! I was, I was thinking of the wrong, the wrong animal. Are you? Wait, hang on. No, Plessy's earthbound. You're thinking of Dory, maybe? Or is Plessy no, no, also... Nessie is earthbound. Plessy is like the orange Dory that's in the the new I, one. I thought that earthbound had something. Ness Nessie. I didn't. I thought they weren't called Nessie and earthbound. Oh, you're thinking of tendas. No, the, no, I'm thinking the big of the... monster was Nessie. Yeah, was it Nessie? Oh, jeez. Okay, well, or Tessie. I'm sorry. Yeah, Tessie. No. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I, I knew it wasn't a straight up I... called Nessie. Uh... No, Nessie's the real one. Yeah, I know. I got confused because there's <laughs> I... also a Nessie the boy in it. <laughs> I'm from the part of the world where we're kind of familiar with Nessie. Scotland. You might have heard of it. <laughs> Please don't know Celtics. I'm so upset. <laughs> Me sigh. <laughs> oh, thank you for yucky bread, sale sales -o. Sales wizard. The sales wizard. On <laughs> natural twenty, I will bite you. No. Me messick. So yeah, uh, for folks that. New Mexico describes the condition of my home. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, Do you think the the uh, tendas were such scaredy cats in Earthbound because they were chicken tendas? <laughs> you you earned that. It's fair. <laughs> I, the answer is Charlie Problem, your girlfriend. <laughs> when in doubt. Yeah, it's been nice down here. Thank you for, if not yeah. inviting us to your house, then at least putting up with us after we kind of accidentally teleported into your house. I have enjoyed 
chopping on all of the various funguses that are all about. Oh. There are indeed plenty of funguses among us. Poobers and funguses. Can you transfer that threatened bite to me on to sleep, please? Um... Uh, honey, I will bite you because of a thing that Unnatural20 said. No! My unbitten parts. They're mm -hmm. gone. Chomp. That's what it sounds like when I bite someone. <laughs> not not the squelching sound, the chomp. Maybe the you've squelching got that, sound. You've got that disease where every noise you make is just somebody saying the word, the onomatopoeia. Oh. We're constantly digging a big hole, and the stream the stream ends when we have dug the hole so deep that we cannot possibly extricate ourselves until the next stream. I'm good at digging myself into a hole. Mm -hmm. but the disease where every noise sounds like toad. Oof. How's your toad voice? <laughs> Perfect, wonderful. <laughs> that was getting fun made of me over on <laughs> Cobalt Tune earlier. Also, by the way, if you're not following Cobalt Tune, you should. And For your bad toad impression? No. Uh, that's weird. Why is my Cobalt Tune button not working? Oh, there we are. Um, no, for my bad droopy Im impression. No. Oh. <laughs> I was trying to, I was trying to do droopy, and it didn't work. All right, hit us with it. Oh no. Well, you I'm, gotta. Well, I'm, well, I'm, <laughs> I'm, no. I'm droopy. I'm so sad. <laughs> Oh no, she's choking on peanut butter. <laughs> I told you it wasn't very good. I'm, I'm going to work more fuck. No going down, sir. <laughs> See, yours is better. It doesn't quite have the, the mouthful of marbles that Droopy kind of has. Maybe you should stop eating marbles. You first, asshole. No! <laughs> Crunch. <laughs> How's your teeth, by the way? <laughs> I've replaced them with titanium mega daggers. Neat. The impression works better if you only stretch one cheek. I wasn't stretching any cheeks. Yeah. I'm so sad. I'm droopy. Oh, oh no. Oh, God. Mm, I pinched my cheek too hard. Ah. It's like the fury of a thousand grandmas has descended <laughs> upon, upon my poor cheek. Well, um, oh, I should have brought myself an uh, egg a porter. I forgot that was a thing in this game. Oh, I will bring you an egg in this trying time. Gorge. Gorge. Max. <laughs> All I can do is a, a vaguely desperate Max. Max. Uh -huh. <laughs> See, my, ba one. my banjo's on point. Wow. Uh -huh. the, the banjo goofy slider is kind of not very gay. <laughs> I love that game. Banjo Kagoofy. <laughs> God. 
Kazooie is not. Wait, hang on a sec. I was literally doing this on Kobol 2 earlier. Oh, uh, uh, no. <laughs> uh, welcome to Girl Stream Team just makes noises for three hours. <laughs> I mean, you joke, but... <laughs> <laughs> what part of that sounded like I was joking? Okay, fair. I'm glad you think that, Spiffy, because that means that my impressions are still valuable. And I will not be put in <laughs> the bad impressions uh, disintegration device. Alright, Jax, give me your, your best impression of... Uh-huh. Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> Who? <laughs> exactly. What, what was he in? Uh, like Braveheart. Uh. Not not I like his no not idea. like his not like his. The... I don't know. Oh. I don't know what he's been in or what he sounds like. It's but... just a name that came into my mind. Hey, it's me, Matthew McConaughey. Oh, oh that's great. That's <laughs> awesome. Now it's a sort of goofy McConaughey banjo triptych that we're no, doing. That, that's, that's just what he sounds like. Murph, 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 Murph. Merge. Demerge. How poor me. How me. How me. We're in Undertale. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Homie, we're in The Last of Us. <laughs> oh, ouch. Oh, my body. Oh jeez. Okay, so the big tentacles do sling things that stun you. I get it. What if Homer electroplated himself with shiny metal and become Cromer then? Yeah, that's how my my one Chow got born. <laughs> Cromer Samson. Hey, what if what if Cromer Samsung? What if hmm. it was the Samsungs? Hmm. Are and they all just phones? Yeah, sitting like on a couch. Has have they sold out so much so that like surely, surely someone has pitched that marketing tie up, right? Almost certainly. Yeah, it's the Samsungs. Whoa. What? You know, I deserve that. <laughs> Did you pass away of of? of... Fungus violence. Yeah, it turns out that not only does the um, funny spore throwing tendril um, do stun damage, but also it does um, hurting damage that kills you. Oh. Oh, the geez. Simpsons were vagabonds, there'd be Romer Simpson. <laughs> the Don Hertzfeld uh, couch gag is. Probably the best The Simpsons have been in a long while. <laughs> Weirdly emotive and poignant. Oh my god, World of Tomorrow, I can not watch again. I watched it once and it like it sent me into a place that I'm not sure where. I that don't was... think I was the same person coming out of it. 
That was the follow-up to everything will be all okay. Or the that was uh uh it was one of the movies that he did. Yeah. It was the one that was not about someone dying of cancer. It was the uh, I th well, it's the one about someone who's like losing their memory. Oh, was that? I thought cancer was part of it, but I, th I think I'm pretty sure that's everything will be all, everything is going oh, to be fine. Maybe that's the one I'm thinking of then. Yeah, I think World of Tomorrow is when, like, uh, there's a girl and she travels back and uh, her future self travels back in time to try and figure out who she was because. Her future self. Is oh like, yeah. right, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I know what. I have seen that one. Like, oh. all of Don Hertzfeld's work seems extremely good, but the only one that I'm really capable of emotionally engaging with, unless I've had a really good day, <laughs> is rejected. <laughs> and even that one can get a little rough. There's a part of me that feels like we're not prepared for fungus to just drop straight up money. I think so. I think we're perfectly ready for fungus town. Dude, did we manage to kill the flesh boss thing yesterday? We did. We did, yeah. So we are in uh, the final area of the game as currently released, I think. Um, which um, has a big funny bird boss by the looks of it. Mm -hmm. And uh, we need to. Oh grab... yeah, the the core woke up. It had a little eyeball, and it was it was chatting with us. It was like, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, uh, oh. shit's shit's kind of fucked, huh? That's <laughs> I'm weird. For a while. What's going on? That's weird. I'm sure there was a civilization here. <laughs> My entire civilization. And me too. Oh my god. Ow. They hurt so bad, though, is the thing about it. Oh, but there is, a, there is a big chest over there, so... Ah. Oh. Fantastic chest ahead. Oh, that one just had a fungal yeah, bone in a... it. Ugh. Yeah, I don't like that much. Yeah, it seems like the core is like an ancient... ...computer or something? Maybe mm -hmm. not computer, but... I have like... got a lot of stacks of funny fungus on myself, and I don't like it. Ah. Yeah. Is this the mold from Control? Uh, probably not. Controlled. Control. God, I want to make you play Control on stream so bad. Do it. I want to. Mm -hmm. Oh! Oh! Oh, this is the... Woo! <laughs> yeah, right! <laughs> okay. Borgus, Thorgus Morgus and the mouth-watering Borgus. Thanks. Thanks, Boothbot. <laughs> Extremely faith face voice. Morgus. <laughs> Morgus. Morgus. Yeah, for folks who have not been here for any of our Core Keeper streams thus far, um, Core Keeper is a survival crafting game, and we are not doing particularly well at the survival part right now, as evidenced by the fact that we've died a uh -huh. few times. Um, I have found a Pufungi. A Pufungi? A Pufungi. Me? Me? What? I don't know. 
Okay. I'm dying. I can't look to see what the Pofyunji is. Uh -huh. I hope it's like a delicious puffball mushroom. That would be nice. You know, we should have probably built a couple of Grubzookas, huh? Probably wouldn't have been the worst. Mm -hmm. Like, thing one, it's called a Grubzooka. Are there any plans for more tunic streams? Absolutely, yes. We do want to do yeah. more tunic. Um, it's just that we kind of decided to dedicate this whole week to this game because sometimes you just gotta let yourself get obsessed with the thing. <laughs> it'll it'll be fairly soon. I think we were thinking of, of putting it in our Sunday slots, although um, this coming Sunday is a special. Yes, this Special coming one. this coming Sunday is. Oh jeez! I sure wish that guy wasn't there. This coming Sunday is going to be a uh, celebration stream of one year of Girl Stream Team. Technically, the anniversary is on Saturday, but um, I won't tell anyone if you don't. So, um, yeah. We are going to be playing a uh, Mario Party with our pals over at Cobalt Toon. Uh, we'll be streaming on this channel, and yeah, uh, we're excited to just chill and have a fun little party with everyone. Mm -hmm. Look, we've gotten through. Well, at least I got Soon through one. To be rivals. <laughs> I mean, they are already technically our um, arch rivals, so you know. Hmm. Don't you remember that we were having some kind of? There was something we were doing to the death. I can't remember what it was now. Uh, it was like our first to two hundred, right? Yeah, and they. I don't remember the to the death part because I feel like. I feel like the death hasn't happened yet. I mean, we got better. Uh, right. Wormy, what has been your most recent obsession? Uh, I mean, besides Core Keeper, uh, we've been very unsatisfactory. Uh, yeah, that's been our, our paired obsession for a bit now. Oop. I got a Pafungi Seed. That's exciting. I've been... On my own, and in non-video game terms, I guess, have been feeling such a lack of time and need to just do anything at all creative. I've been watching a lot of, like, um, stuff about map making and stuff, usually in D&D &D terms or tabletop terms. Mm -hmm. Which has been entertaining to watch. We're also starting to do a little bit of The Sims together. Oh god, yeah. Are we, uh... I, I think I started watching a couple of uh, Little Simsies videos. Uh, who's a, a pretty prominent uh, Sims 4 uh, YouTuber. And, um, yeah, her stuff was just like, ah, oh, ah, oh, this is extremely good. And then <laughs> uh, at some point she just came out and fucking said, hey, if you're a fucking transphobe, if you're any kind of queerphobe, fuck off. This isn't for you. Oh, so bless. It's like, yeah, it's like, ah, fucking good. Isn't it nice to... That's what I've done with some of the folks I've been... Oh, I'm out of gun. Oh, run. I'll try and cover your escape. 
I'll do that while I'll, I'll find somebody, even with this mant making stuff, and be like, oh, they're kind of neat. I need to look up their Twitter to see Our if they're like, shit lord. cool. <laughs> and it's always great when I'm like, oh, I didn't expect this person to have pronouns in their bio, but they mm -hmm. did, and I feel, <laughs> I feel so good. Mm -hmm. Who said that? Oh, that was uh, Lil Simsy. Um, a uh, cool as hell uh, Sims tuber. I know, Julie. I'm sorry that I beefed it live on stream again. Okay. I'm quite excited that that chest busted open. Um, and it does seem to have a cool red sword in it. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I think it's just a free Scarlet Sword, baby. <gasps> I got it. A blowpipe, a Scarlet Sword, and a greater healing potion. Nice. A blowpipi. Blowpipi. Wow. 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 Huh? Bit less than half the damage of the musket, but like three times the attack fire rate. Oh shit, that might actually be Ooh. plus chance to point to Poisson. Poisson. Ooh. Who is everyone's Fridays, by the by? Whoop! Uh, hey! You're... <clears throat> oh, that's you! Is that you? No, that's not you! No. It sure isn't. Oh, the fucking farmer who is hostile to me. Oh. I was like, wait, what the fuck? I have passed. No. Passed on. A bunch of boys respawned and I was so slow. No. That's a lot of beans. It's a frightening amount of beans. Make a, a hell of a bean salad. Oh. Move over three bean salad. It's, it's a 110,000 bean salad. Oh. It's a hearty bean salad. Mm -hmm. If you want a bean feast, <laughs> like that weird girl. Who? What? What's her name from Willy Wonka who wanted the bean feast? Did she want a bean feast? I don't know. It was a fucking weird thing to ask for. What does that mean? I don't know. I want to just eat. A giant bowl of baked beans and get launched into space by the inevitability of that. <laughs> a bean feast is an old English work tradition. Well, Julie, I, I did what you said and got out of there. You made like a tree? I made like a tree and fucking died. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay, we got the chest. We let's get our stuff back and cut our losses from Fungi Town because, <laughs> oof, ouch, my bones. The choice of fungus. <laughs> Hello. Oh. <laughs> Surprised you haven't been riding the rails. I have been. Oh, because I just kind of. Oh, you died again, I guess. I... I... teleported. Oh, you teleported. I see, I see. That makes sense. Okay, I'm gonna go grab my stuff. I get a bit more iron, we can make those grubzookas.
good because somehow all that iron is gone. <laughs> I think some of it might have gone into making the new smelters because I got very excited about the prospect of smelting um, ah. Scarlet. I see. Ah, oh, my grub farm is working. Oh. That's all my stuff. I'm getting the fuck out of here. <laughs> Which I mean, I'm gonna hunt for a little bit more Scarlet first. Oh, uh oh. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Guys, who in tight? I think I got the mic just in time. You did, I think. <laughs> okay. Some also link it to the Twelfth Night Feast, where a hardened bean would be found in the cake and cause the crowning of the king for the night. Hey! resident British person, I should have probably have known that, but... Eh. <laughs> yeah, what the heck? Ah, please tell us about your funny dream. Very bad at being British, so I moved away. That's. <laughs> they voted me off the island. the bigger it scrim. Understandable. Hmm. of the nature of Puffungi. Ooh, what is the nature of Puffungi? It... It lets you cook things that reduce damage from bosses. What? Yeah. <laughs> Just specifically bosses? Yep. That's fuck wild. Oh, god. This guy's got a gun. Oh no. We're good. It's good to see you again. That's very fair. Mm -hmm. Although now I don't know who you are. Ooh. <gasps> wow. Thank you for the 100 bits, Coil Twitch bot. <laughs> I appreciate it. 
I'm confused, but pleased. Yeah, Stinks, what, what do you prefer to be uh, referred to as these days? Because I think last time um, I was aware, um, I think last time you are going, okay, you just Stinks. Okie doke. Yeah. We can do that. Shall be so. A sound plan. For my ancestors. Join the navy, they said. Funny fungus room. Mm -hmm. Fungus. Very expensive fungus. Okay. Okay, let's. Let's just read Wormy's Dream. Uh, sitting on a couch in what looked like a very boomer home, browsing Twitter, and out of nowhere a trans pride flag flew at me and wrapped itself around me like a blanket. It spoke to me and the voice uh -huh. sounded like Jim Carrey and said, You have Spock! I like that! Then I saw the word silly little trans. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> that is the most fucking... FMVS cutscene dream I've ever heard of. Yeah, yeah. Dang. <laughs> I like it. Oh yeah, you should you should cook that giant mushroom into a food so that you can eat it and um have the permanent health buff. Maybe I will. Oh, do you want the this cool sword and or blowgun i would love this cool sword oh, what a cool sword actually ah oh. Oh, uh, what? What? Ah, uh, I just made giant mold cheese. What? Nasty. Oh. That's a few gravestones. Gus fun, as opposed to Gus among. Enjoyable Gus. Oh, it's a you check. So Stinks checked the profile of the bot, and it's a wandering dono bot. Stuff like that's common on Twitch, and really only form of bots I accept. Uh, bots like that are programmed to roam various channels using an algorithm, which may or may not have program bias. It's hard to tell, and given the set amount of bits from a pool the programmer has. Hmm. Neat. <laughs> I, I guess I'm fine with that. That's kind of rad. <laughs> oh. 
random or at least procedural acts of kindness. Okay, have you got yourself a scarlet pick yet? I do not. Get yourself a scarlet pick. That? Uh, yes, on the Scarlet Workbench. What do, need? do we have this, what we need for it? I don't think we have any tin. Back. <laughs> uh, okay, then I'm gonna go and find a tin deposit and hook a drill up to it, I guess. Or actually, no, I'm gonna go and find some tin and just chew through it with my bare teeth. The one thing that Jim Carrey is in my thoughts for um, almost perpetually is um, this thing that he did at the Game Awards this year? Question mark? Whatever the most recent uh -huh. Game Awards was, where he just, for no evident reason, did a fucking terrible Scottish accent and just went, my, my father gave me one bit of advice that's stuck with me to this day, and it was, don't grate it on the grinder! Don't grate it on the grinder! And he just kept doing that for like two minutes straight. Uh, and it was just like... I feel offended? <laughs> Wow, what a wild uh, new set of perks I have for gardening. Oh, well, I can either I can either get one that um, gives me an extra percentage of food if I'm eating something with vegetables in it, mm -hmm. or I can get a percentage chance not to use uh, some of the water in the watering can. Oh. <laughs> This is, that... is useless. <laughs> is that perk called peas just as good, right? <laughs> Bottomless water can. Cool perk. Uh... Oh, yeah. I don't want to benefit from vegetables. I just want to not have to move to this adjacent well to refill my watering can mm -hmm. once every other harvest. I have found a giant block of tin that I'm going to set up a big old drill next to. Excellent. I'm sort of hoping that the lower tier metals get mined faster than the Scarlet does. Fingers oh. crossed. Be nice. Ah, oh, never mind. We don't have enough iron. Aw, oh, yeah. <laughs> God. Uh, oh. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna have to check out that coil bot um, for a stream because I'm I'm interested. Huh. Well, on the plus side, I came back with um, like twenty tin that I mined acoustically, so you should be able to get your um, funky little um, scarlet pick. White boy. Oh. What did you say? Wait, boy? Did... <laughs> well, thank you for the headpats. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, that's for the Zelda game that no one likes. Hey, gargle my Narthak. <laughs> Gladly. Also, Zelda 2 is good, actually. It's just different. Got bad music, at least. Oh. 120 slimes, wow. Oh, Stinks is going full Nancy Drew. Love it. <laughs> and I mean that... I mean that complimentary. <laughs> Nancy Drew, brackets, complimentary. <laughs> Puffy berry pudding. Oh. Eight percent reduced damage taken from bosses for five minutes. Hey. Good night, Wormy. Oh, sleep good, Wormy. Thanks for coming along. Expedition that she really should have. What's that? Tag. Porter? Oh no. A coil anonymous attracts the amount of time its members spend watching Twitch affiliates and partners gradually converts the watch time into USD. The balance is high enough it can use that USD to purchase and give bits to a specific streamer that member watches via a cheer. That's hmm. fucking wild. Okay. Um. Well. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I suppose to whomstever <laughs> owns that bot and whomstever is uh, a member of COIL. Too bothered in um, 
figuring that one out. Oh, hello. Hello. Escargo Express special delivery. One egg. Thank you. It's everything I've dreamed of. Well, shit, now we've got to solve the mystery of who, sh who shot stinks. <laughs> Big iron. Ooh. <laughs> See if you can equip it in the leg slot. Here's some, another special delivery. Yummy. I made it myself. Oh, thank Watches you. you with expectant joy on my face. And okay. I have to take a bite and pretend you love it. Okay, I'm right over here. I have the cheese in my hand, and oh. I have the cheese in my mouth. Yum. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Oh, that was a TF2 reference. Okay. And we're still going to try and solve your murder. It was the scorned. The scorned? The, the scrant. It was the scrote. The sc <laughs> Eat the scrunch. <laughs> Intro to biology uh, syllabus that uh, does um, uh -oh. all uh -oh. of its uh -oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> that does all of its uh, syllabus as uh, meet the blank videos. Meet the pancreas. <laughs> ah, I'd love to. I don't leave home without this thing. <laughs> oh no, that's not a real thing. That's a thing that I'm proposing. Unless you're going, wait, really, to sleep not leaving home without her pancreas. <laughs> Big city. I've got so many ocarinas. Oh. It's about time. The phospholipid bilayer. <laughs> There's some iron over here. My picks run out of pick sauce. No. stream. It's true. I also found a couple more wells, though. Ooh. Just kind of... I don't really have a need for them, but... Uh... Mm -hmm. I think they're neat. Decoration. Yeah.
Okay, call is run by a small group in San Fran. Neat. Hmm. Oh, did our mics cut out? Uh, hopefully not. Oh, he hello. Oh, they're oh. back. Okay. We we might have just been quiet for a little bit. <laughs> Okay, there should be enough iron in that chest for you to get an iron pick now, I think. Uh, I mean, a scarlet pick. Uh, what? You mean this scarlet pick? Oh, you got one already. Nice. Sorry. You needed tin, not iron. Oh, yeah. We already solved that a while ago. I forgot about that. What did we need? Uh -oh. oh, we need iron for the funny drill. That was it. Oh. Uh. Oh, to get the tin to get the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, ho, 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 ho. Do we want to see what we're up against with Big Funny Bird? Oh. I think we've got enough stuff uh, to check that out, at least. Sure. I'm uh, giving myself a little change in equipment here. Sure. Um, if you want a glow ring. Oh, there's actually two in here now. All right, then. Never mind. Mm -hmm. I would dearly like one of those gemstones. Oh, well, there you go. It's Jimmy Stones. Cheese it, you mooks. It's Jimmy Stones. Golly. Oh, the pets. Thank you, Paula. Meow, 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 meow. Meowing, thank you. Meowing seven times. I've also uh, begun making some potions. They are in the blue chest, if you want any. I do think I would like some potions, yes. More head pets, thank you. Really. Wow. wow, so many, thank you. Wow, 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 head pets received. Wow, wow. Which was that Grubzooka? I wonder if it does multiple hits on an enemy as it pierces through them. Yeah, hopefully. If they're big enough, probably. Yeah. So it's like the same. It does do less damage than our hand mortars by the looks of it. Because mm -hmm. it's like 82 to 100 range damage, but it pierces. So. Arr. It tears down dirt, sand, and turf walls in its path, which. I think it's turf walls up in. Um, uh, tomato Town. Uh. You know, the north. Sure. Uh, 
very least, I want to see what it looks like. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. Sorry, did you need that? <laughs> Not necessarily. Zuka, eh? Ah, the damage isn't spectacular, but as a mining tool, my god. Oh, really? Yeah. Come up to the north and watch this fucking thing go. Okay. Oh, okay. And I think this will work in, you know, as we said, Tomato Town, so. Mm hmm. Oh, uh, Lily asks, favorite science fact you each learned recently? Ew. Um, mm. what, what is the science fact that I've learned recently? This is one of those questions where immediately the entire... I've forgotten everything that's ever happened. The entire corpus of scientific knowledge has fallen out of my skull. <laughs> Hmm. I'm not really sure. There should there should <laughs> yeah. be something there. <laughs> I guess one of the things that I learned somewhat recently is um, I don't know if this really counts as a science fact, but the very point on a tidally locked planet that's like most directly facing the star that it orbits mm -hmm. is not going to be the hottest point. If it has an atmosphere. Oh, wow. Because, um, or at least as long as it's got uh, a water body there, because mm -hmm. it's going to be covered in clouds just from the, the heat um, mm -hmm. sort of making water around that whole mm -hmm. side of the planet mm -hmm. rise. Mm -hmm. It's actually kind of a weirdly lobster shaped. Um, heat pattern where the two points above and below that yeah, you sh spot. You, sh you showed me the big lobster, yeah. Yeah, and then the part to the east of it, or whichever way is um, the planet is spinning because of the Coriolis effect, it kind of wipes everything to one side and it kind of looks mm -hmm. like a lobster. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to ask that cheat. cloud cover might might have a lot to do with keeping that side of the planet somewhat cooler because it's going to change the albedo mm -hmm. on what would otherwise be the hottest part so yeah i'm, I'm gonna have to cheat and say that's the coolest science fact i've learned recently yeah <laughs> because my girlfriend is good at science and i have a tiny little brain oh no hey let's go and kick this bird's ass how's how's your uh yumbometer uh i mean i could use some yums if you've got some spare. Perfect. Alright, let's let's see what that can happens. Mm -hmm. yeah.
Actually, wish... you know what? I what? thought of a better science fact now that the pressure's off. Oh, <laughs> nice. Uh, is actually from uh, the stuff that you linked, Lily. I, I learned about um, from those bug ferrets another kind of um, oxygen transport protein called chlorocruorin, which oh. is free floating in the blood of certain worms, I think, uh, rather than being in like blood cells. And oh, it's shit. very similar to hemoglobin, but it's also dichromatic. So it goes from like a light green, I think, to a to a dull red. That's cool. So that's kind of cool. Oh yeah, a little farmer. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh it, it planted something. He. Oh no. Christmas blood. Oh. <laughs> okay. So how do I was kind of assuming you had a plan for uh Whoa. Oh. What the hell was that? Where did you get that? Uh, traitor. Ah. <laughs> Interesting. I immediately beefed it. <laughs> it's pretty beef immediate. Hmm. Are you still alive? I am. Nice. Is it just doing the funny lasers, or does it have more up its sleeve? Uh, it's spawned some... Whoa! Oh! Yeah. It's got more. Oh. I'm coming as fast as I can. <gasps> oh no! Oh god. Oh! Oh! Jeez! Hey! Hello. Oh, I can't actually get over there. My mining damage is too low. Yeah, uh, turns out those heal it. The crystals? The crystals. Oh wait, hang on. I can, I can fuck it up with the, um, with the pick. I was trying sword. Ah. That's a lot of crystals for it to be healed by. Yeah, it sure is, huh? Mm -hmm. Whoop! Well, you can't just spawn it on top of me. That's not very fair, is it? That's kind of rude. like if you keep destroying the crystals it has fewer of them to pull from and its energy beams connect fewer of them but it's not like destroying all of them causes it big damage or stuns it or anything it's just 
Yeah, it just, it just like Dang makes it. it have to take a second before it can start to heal again. Oh, if birds aren't real, then explain all the bird furries. Um, I mean, protogens. Yeah. I was gonna say uh, government drones, but <laughs> that kind of also covers it. I I want to be clear. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. <laughs> uh, okay. I want, now we're I, good. I want to be clear. Girl Stream Team does not endorse the fucking weird conspiracy theory that uh, birds all died and the government replaced them with spy drones. Because that's wild. <laughs> we we don't we don't like that one. We think that one's just a it's a it's a funny idea, but, but it's not real. I mean, it's an ascended joke because I think some people. You can't, you can't think... just spawn them on a top of me. <laughs> Mamma mia! It's not the various bottom and like. What are you doing? The <laughs> rocks are actually very soft. But... What? <laughs> Get nervous and tense up when you touch them. I love that. <laughs> Oh, me forgot mine cart. Me left another uh, corpse. Mm. <sighs> so, kind of seems so. like. Um, all the other bosses are balanced for you to fight them at roughly whatever order you feel like. This, you know, what would be a, a funny little thing, honestly. Uh -huh. Oh, it's back up in the air. Uh, oh. It kind of seems like those uh, Grubzookas would really help. Oh, well, maybe? I mean, it keeps spawning all these big things we have to mine in little clusters. Yeah, that's a good point. I feel like just being able to shoot grubs to blow them all up would be really helpful. Mm -hmm. Rocks make good pets for lazy people. Well, that's true. I had a pet rock. Still do, I think. <laughs> well, hopefully it didn't... <laughs> it didn't die on you. <laughs> I don't think so. I, I think it was, like, sold as a, a gonk or something like that. It had a funny little face on it. Very cute. Oh, man, the summoning crystal is really expensive. Me. Now, what's the chance of us being able to dig out a pattern here that it won't be able to summon those things? <laughs> it it will one hundred percent just create terrain underneath them. Like, yeah, you're like right. I'm sure that the this was kind of a bit more hollow before, and now it's been filled in where it's decided I I want crystal. I just noticed that all my armor's broken except for my head. Oh no. Well Well Time to find more Scarlet, oh. I guess. It's just a piece of Scarlet sitting right there. Yeah, it blew up a lot of the terrain, so suddenly there's just a lot of Scarlet around. Neat. I guess it sort of makes sense that the funny bird bosses, um, 
extremely difficult, <laughs> considering it seems to be the last bit of um, boss content in this uh, game as released. Uh, I'm gonna check out our goddamn drill. <laughs> I'm upset. <laughs> All right. Where's our other traitor? He's just gone. Oh. Oh, there he is. He's like <laughs> down in the caverns for some reason. Oh my hey, god. Bud. That's some powerful emojis. Those. Ah, oh, those are very strong. I, I think if we like close the door uh, to the traitor's room and then walk away and come back again, they'll respawn back in. Oh. Uh, the room, yeah. Like, fine, I'll go to my room. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Check on Yahoo Answers how to beat the funny bird boss. I, I, uh, what, 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 what happened? What, what? Oh, I was riding in my mic cart and it was sideways, which was fun, and then it was just gone. Oh, and then I walked back to the start of the track and it was sitting there. <laughs> cool. Oh shit, they've got a knife. <gasps> no, put that down. Good. That sounded bad. Did you hear? This? Did you hear that gasp? Yeah, there was. I found one of those big club ogres. I just kind of bumped into him. Oh, jeez. But I'm fine.
Mr. Tin Man, sell me your tin. I am a monument to all of your sin. <laughs> well, fucking <laughs> done. <laughs> Minecart was in my corpse pants again. Way past cool. Yeah. Oh, way past cool. Within the realms of cool. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Thank you, little jar that just had three iron ore in it. Sweet. That's a good jar. Uh huh. Oh, and a golden Karak. Ooh. Oh, oh, fancy version of cool stone vegetable. Yeah. Yeah. Getting a little bit of a sense that uh, Bird Boss might take some grinding to to defeat. Yeah, no. But again, maybe um, maybe the armor, the Scarlet armor upgrade will help, but it's still a shit ton of Scarlet. Yeah, I think. I... Hmm. You the armor doesn't feel like it really does a, a, a vast amount to help us. Considering, like, even now the the dudes over by the Iron Zone will just kill you in a couple of hits. I, I guess, but, like, it's the difference between dying immediately and dying in a couple of hits, and, like... It's true. It gives you time to back off and yeah. Swig a potion. Like, before we had any armor at all, the spiked slimes were just completely wrecking our shit. That's true. I, I think Paramount is going to be dealing with those healing things that it does, because that's ridiculous. Yeah. Like, you'll just spawn five of them, and if it hooks up to one, it's pretty much back at full health, no matter what you've done. Yeah, and I don't know what our counter to that is, except for just breaking them and... Yeah, I, I feel like the Grubzook is probably our best shot at dealing with them. Mm -hmm. If if nothing else, it's mining from a distance. I mean, the Grubzooka doesn't 
strictly have any actual mining um, stat. It's just uh, it busts through uh, certain types of terrain. Um, Maybe the hand mortars are better? Maybe. I don't think I had a proper chance to try them out in our last... Oh god, I'm fucking out of here. <laughs> Fuck this. <laughs> Um, yeah, maybe the hand mortars are our, our best bet there. It's like there's, there's got to be something we can do, right? Mm -hmm. Can't be helpless. In the face of a big funny bird. Silly bird. I am the pretty okay Leon. <laughs> okay, so let's see. So all the Scarlet stuff gives some bonus max health. And again, so does the carapace stuff. Let's see, it's like 10, 15, 12 for the iron here. And then uh, 12, 19, 16 for the scarlet gear. Hmm. Good night, Lily. Good night, Lily. Sick tight. Mm -hmm. It does give a bunch of bonus critical hit chance, which is nice. Hmm. Like, it definitely feels like the main things in that boss fight that's going to benefit us is just being quick on our feet, avoiding its patterns and, like... Yeah, the, um... Those things move slowly enough that I'm not worried about them, unless they're spawning right on top of me. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, but moving out of their way isn't too bad. Hunting for some more tin so that we can resummon that big bad bird. Mm -hmm. Remember this? Our little dude here just sells that. Oh, you okay? Yeah. <laughs> Understood. Well, I guess I'm gonna do some agriculture. It's very agriculture, don't you? Ah, uh, can we make a, like a farm-based fighting game and call it Agro Culture? <laughs> we can and should. Shit, 
wrong way for things. It's okay, because the grub zoo could just... <laughs> means that most walls I just don't care about anymore. <laughs> These walls will not be grub zooped. This means I'm in tin country. I was sort of expecting that after destroying all of the crystals that the bird was connected to, it would kind of have some Get kind of hurt. Yeah, there would be some kind of shock reaction or something like that, but uh -huh. no, it was just like, oh, all my crystals. Fuck you, here's yeah. my crystals. Yeah. Tin that we should be able to get a second shot. So, dang, I think <laughs> two more rings of stone. Hmm. Guess I'll sell them. We've got the spare ring of rock and ring of stone in the gear chest, so. Yeah, we may as well. Oh, they're worth. The princely sum of seven monies each, so... Oh, boy! <laughs> well, I cooked that rare Karak and it does not give a permanent buff. So, boo. Oh, uh, you sleep nice. well, Julie. Thanks for coming along.
Or spicy mold cheese. My favorite. Mm. Not the worst to have, I don't think. Yeah, anything that reduces boss damage is good in my book. I've acquired another shiny trinket. Okay, I feel prepared. Mm -hmm. There's some more potions in there. I think I've got all the potions I need. Got okay. some st stuff to experiment with the with mining. That's true. Alright. Well, no time like the present, I suppose. Let's do it. Don't have a teleporter eye, but I guess that's fine. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> We're only going to get teleported back here. One way or another. Birds cannot be teleported. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I'll just arrange my bar strategically. Mm -hmm. Chug your buffs. Yep. And let's do it. Oh, shoot. I managed to make the window small. Oh no. Oh no. Grubzuka just passes right through. Yep, and uh, hand mortar is not good. Nope. So I think we just need to take these down fast as we can. Uh, I got heart. Wow. Okay, that sucks. Sucks and is a shame. Mm. You little asshole! You can't just keep spawning those fucking things. Oh, it can. Shit, do you have that blowgun? Maybe you just poison it. <laughs> oh, that was a good idea that I'm 
Unfortunately, I died. Oh, uh, well. Uh, maybe just still be standing when you get back there. We'll find out. Cheap. That chugs. <laughs> uh, I don't think we've got enough resources for another run tonight. So we'd have to. No, it's gonna take another like half an hour to to mine all that stuff again. Clearly, we're meant to, yeah, have a lot more than we presently have. I think so. Yeah, and like, especially the cool sword that it looks like we can craft if we find, you know, the last component of it. Wherever the hell that is. Yeah. Because, like, I'm hitting it and getting a little tink noise with the scarlet sword, so I feel like maybe funny funny good sword is um, the way to go. Hey, Vera! Hello, Vera. Yeah, it's a shame that, that it doesn't just stay summoned after you spend a ton of resources on that thing. I was sort of hoping it would, yeah. But at least Longworm, like, stayed in his second phase so you wouldn't have to dick about with it again if you died. Exactly, yeah, yeah. That's a shame. Like, I was hoping that maybe it would you know, leave the funny egg, or... <laughs> yeah. Uh... That's a pain. I <laughs> sort of wanted to end our run with this game on a on a more victorious ah, we've seen what there is to see and we're gonna come back and do this more after it's been updated <laughs> instead it's like, <laughs> stupid fucking bird! <laughs> we all hate birds! <laughs> so I don't know, maybe we do some grinding off stream and um Come back to uh, to this for a one a one off next week, and we beat this fucking bird up. Yeah, we have that. Mm -hmm. I would very much like to take the time to just do some building. I would be down for that as well. Yeah. And show off our cool super base afterwards. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I think I've, I oh these are these slimes are different. Ooh. Oh poison slime. Oh boy. We needed that fun. We needed that for something, but I can't remember what. Poison? Maybe. Seems likely. There was some recipe on one of the advanced work tables, I think, that was like a bunch of advanced stuff and poison slime. like at least that poison in this is not uh, tick damage but um, it's 
you uh, your healing's less effective. That's I know. something at least. Find another one of them are evil farmers. <laughs> trees. Actual ass trees. Fine, we can't have been defeated by that bird because birds aren't real. It's true. A real victory goes to us, the truth havers. Mm -hmm. Is that. Are those misty depths or stinky butt water? I think those are misty depths. Out of wood and thus out of bridges, alas. I can't have any of this wood, it's mine. Aww. Okay. Thank you. I I say we wrap up here, because like <laughs> I don't think we're <laughs> gonna achieve too much more. Enjoy cheese. Oh, I will enjoy cheese. And exit game. Yummy. So, after a week of Core Keeper, what do we think of it? I think it is pretty good. Yeah, I've definitely enjoyed it. It's really nice. It's got some good chilled music. It's um, mm -hmm. got a lot of stuff in there for um, a fairly modest price tag. Like, uh, I enjoy the um, the farming and bug keeping and mm -hmm. cooking and stuff. That's fun. Yeah, like, chat didn't see a lot of that because, um, you know, I was kind of off uh, mining and exploring, but... I, uh, I like the way that you've got the evil farmers in that biome to kind of show you, hey, I, I know you might think it's stupid to, to put stuff down that spawns enemies, but check this out. Yeah. You just farm. Yeah. Okay, cool. Make a little bug That's actually kind of cool. I would have was... done a slime farm too, but we're always fighting slimes all the time forever, so. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, I'd, I'd highly recommend it if uh, folks are interested in, like, a survival crafting game that's a bit different from what uh, you're used to. Maybe with a few notes of Terraria, just with, I feel, slightly faster progression. Um, I, like, let me say this, this is coming from someone who didn't really enjoy Terraria. <laughs> like, I, I've i played Terraria a couple of times and bounced off it a bunch of times, even with uh, sleep there to kind of um, make it a bit more palatable for me. And we, we've definitely enjoyed it together. It's just that... There's a, a weird progression in Terraria where everything feels like you're back to ground zero or square one. It's like mm -hmm. you, you get to a, a new tier of equipment to help you try to get to the next tier of equipment to help you survive at all in this next area so that you can get the next tier of equipment. Mm -hmm. And I guess this has it too, but yeah, it's a little less uh, intense, I guess, with that. It feels like less of a wall, and Terraria also feels a lot more you're gonna need the fucking wiki. This, yeah. um, this we haven't had to uh, 
like the one thing we had to look up was hey how do we make sure that uh, merchants move into our place um because that's not which super... we had guessed correctly anyway so we didn't really yeah. need to do that yeah that's one of the yeah i think uh we're gonna do a raid uh let's see who's streaming at this hour we got ooh well melody's still doing some lst dream emulator oh, nice. feels like uh, that would be a good candidate so let's do that all right Wait. first there we go Okay, folks, well, thanks for hanging out with us. It's been an absolute pleasure to have you here. Um, and yeah, we'll see you again soon, I hope. Um, if you want to stick around for the raid, that'd be rad. Uh, otherwise, yeah, uh, we'll be back on Sunday. Uh, I know the end now stream set says tomorrow. It's incorrect. It's lying. <laughs> we'll be back. We'll be back Sunday at uh, noon Pacific. And uh, yeah, we're going to be playing some Mario Party with uh, Laura and Maddie from Cobaltoon. So uh, get hyped for that. That's our stream anniversary stream. So uh, it'd be yeah, amazing yeah. to see as many folks there as we can get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Bye for now, folks. Mwah. Okay, mwah.